What is deja vu from a biblical perspective? The only reason I use this term is because this is the term that people use to describe that whenever they feel like that they're doing something that they've done before. I'm going to tell you what I believe it is. I'm going to use the book of Revelation as an example. If you've read the book of Revelation, then you understand that John was time traveled into the spirit, into the future. He saw future events. He saw future people that were not born in his day in a future heaven. So God literally time traveled John to the future by his spirit. John was in future heaven. He saw a multitude that no one could number from every tribe, nation, people, and languages. Meaning he saw people that would be saved and in heaven that were not even born in his day because he was transported to the end. This means he probably saw you. Pause this and ponder this and then I'm going to continue. The fact that this is possible shows that there is a place in God where everything that you have done for God already is finished. There's a place in God where if you maintain your walk with Christ, you're in heaven already. It's not currently right now, but it's a place in God because remember, God exists in the past, present, and in the future. God is not bound by time. So there is a future you that exists with God in the future already if you maintain your walk with Christ. That's how John was able to see future people that were not born in his day. Here's a side note. All destiny is is you aligning with what has already happened. And you're just fulfilling the walk of what's already taken place. We understand it is going forward in time. But may I also suggest to you that God works backwards in time? Hence, the Bible says the lamb that was slain from the foundation of the earth. Meaning there was a place in God where the crucifixion already happened at the foundation of the earth. This is why in the Old Testament where messianic prophecies are given, some of them can be past tense. He was bruised for our iniquities, past tense, because it happened already in God. Psalm 23, go read it right now. That mirrors when Jesus was on the cross. David tapped into that prophetically in time travel to speak for the Messiah or the Messiah speaking through him. The lamb was slain from the foundation of the earth. So what is what people call deja vu? I'm of the belief that deja vu, clean your ears out, is a memory from your future self. It feels like I've been here before. It feels like I've done this before. That's because you have. It's such a high spiritual thing that can't be explained fully in our realm, but you're merging with your future self and you're remembering something that happened already. Same if you're in hell in the future. I hope you don't go to hell, but that's your own decision. To get saved, check the pin video on my page. And if you like content like this, follow for more. I have a whole chapter dedicated to this in my book. You can find it on Amazon. This will also be among the things that I'm teaching at the end of the month. It's a three-day course. Time travel, wormholes, portals, and more from a biblical perspective. Click the Eventbrite link and get tickets to join. See you there.